This is my GrowWatt 5000 ES setup. Um, so I, this is the way that I've connected my grow watts, uh, to my home power for us, uh, 240 and 120 volt power. So I have three of these, uh, that I purchased from signature solar. They're in the, uh, parallel configuration. So the, of course these are only providing 240 volts output. Um, they're five K five kilowatt each. So total combined is 15 kilowatt. Um, so I've run all, I've joined them all three. There's, they're just junctioned in here to uh, the two hots and a ground. That feeds into this breaker box. So this breaker panel has only 240 volt connections. So only 240 volt loads, like, you know, your stove, your um, dryer, things like that. And then down here I have the output that's gonna go to the um, auto transformer so we have our power output from here we just have a standard two pole breaker it comes out and delivers power into this box where i just have these bonded um with the the three wires that connect to the auto transformer being that being the, the two hots come in and then you have the neutral come back out so that those combine in here to bring the two hots and the neutral into this breaker panel and this breaker panel is only 120 volt loads you could technically put 240 volt loads in this as well it would just uh add more uh potentially more strain to the well you'd, you'd kind of kind of be limited by this 30 amp breaker that feeds the auto transformer so i don't really want to go over that um so yeah all my 120 volt loads are here 240 volt loads are here so this way if this breaker trips for any reason, anything happens to the auto transformer, um, all power to the 120 volt panel is shut off and that way you don't ever have an open neutral on your 120 volt loads.